myself in the center of kind of a value chain that's, that's, that's part of, you know, product and market management on one side and channel and delivery, you know, on the other. And, and marketing has a central role in defining and bringing in voice of customer, you know, integrating the storytelling and the engagement of customers, working in partnership with key other you know, stakeholders out there like our sales team. And in, in regions, really, again, activating at the, at the customer level and inside the market. And more role in marketing has been on a journey of, of aggregation under um, our chief marketing officer, Eduardo Conrado, uh, over the past few years. And it's a good thing that we were strengthening that, that um, function in the business model, because right now is the time that it's really needed in the company to partner with the other functions like HR and the C-level uh, folks from the other functional groups to really drive and define what this purpose is for the organization. So there's a couple angles and aspects to it. One is around customer engagement and the other is employee engagement. So from a, a customer engagement standpoint, uh, you know, we started looking again at how do we look at, our, at the market? And we really do try to use a customer perspective. And I know this is no great insight at the end of the day. Well, of course, I think we should take a customer perspective. Uh, but it's harder to do in a, in a high tech you know, kind of an environment when you're being driven by, again, the technology, the speeds, the feeds, and everything. And so we really, really do try to use marketing in a function, in a business model to help drive, um, you know, this, even the storytelling, the development, everything from the customer view, uh, you know, end user perspective, solution, then product as opposed to the other way around, which a lot of times starts with, you know, product first. So I think we've done a good job over the years of really starting to re just reorient what we're doing here. Um, but with that, you know, uh, one couple things that we do. Uh, one is to make sure we're seeing uh, through our customers' eyes, and there's a variety of methods and, and methodologies to do that, and, and my purpose today is not to get into all that. The point I want to make here is that one of the ways you have to really make sure you're, you're defining your purpose is understanding your customer's purpose. And this is an example of one of our market segments that's mission critical. I, I spent most of my time in the government business, and, you know, these people put their life on them for all of us, right? And so it's really important to understand why they do what they do. And that, that concept of why and purpose, I'm going to get into that further as I get into this uh, story I'm going to tell you, but it's really important that you understand your customer's purpose and, and why they do what they do so that you can align with it. And one of the ways you can do that is by immersing yourself in their world. Customers love this, and it's, it's um, just one example of many types of, of voice of customer things you can do. But I find it the most powerful because you actually get into their, their shoes. I went to the Maryland Fire and Rescue Institute um, a few years back and spent a day wearing 80 pounds of gear, going into the building, you know, they started a fire, I couldn't see, I had these night goggles, I had to change, and the key thing was our technology, I was wearing my own technology, right? So two-way radios, trying to change channels, big gloves, you know, and, and working with that. Very powerful to get people, you know, in your company in that situation so that they get it, what your customers deal with every day. I had the jaws of life. It was pretty cool stuff, actually. And again, your customers like this because they know then that you really care about what's important to them. So understand why they do what they do, get in their shoes, and figure out how they do what they do. Because as you start to really uh, look at your own purpose, so you've got to have that as sort of the, 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 the arc above you. 